Yo. So today I looked at multiple ways Roblox could have shut down over the years and trust me There's quite a bit as well as I look at some silly TikToks that claim Roblox is shutting down in the next couple days And the reasons are just absolutely crazy, but first guys you're gonna want to talk to my uncle Al Hey brothers, listen, I just heard from Aunt Sally that Chase Rooney is close to a million subscribers So here's the deal you subscribe to him right now. And guess what? I ain't gonna run you over with my truck <laughs> I mean <laughs> Yo, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be looking at, okay, certain times that Roblox might have almost shut down and also look at funny and stupid and just deplorable TikToks claiming that Roblox is going to shut down and why they're, why Roblox is apparently going to shut down soon. Because, you know, I just thought it was funny, guys, because I love going on TikTok and, and knowing that my, that Roblox's impending doom is happening in 2030. And uh, we're going to be looking at it all today. But, you know, as you heard, we got some real reasons, a lot of real reasons that Roblox could have or almost shut down, which is kind of crazy. There's three that I have listed and probably some that I miss. So make sure to comment down below if I, if I miss any. And then I also got unlimited TikToks of just people saying Roblox is going to shut down soon which I just, I just love who doesn't love silly little tiktoks that claim roblox is gonna burst into flames in 4.8 seconds so hold on guys let me just show you guys the tiktok because we're gonna look at the tiktoks first okay you know how these videos work at this point come on two thousand years later so as you can see i just searched up roblox shut down i mean you can't see that i searched that but that's what i did sir oh my gosh guys it's gonna shut down Creecraft is cry he is cry right now because roblox is shout down in 2023 it's july 30th well that is past so it hasn't shut down, but let's see what Creecraft said. Okay, I love the the marshmallow song in the background. Why does this have seventy two thousand likes and almost a million views? <coughs> I'm so confused right now. Am I missing something? Like he didn't. <laughs> Maybe minus two. Oh my god, I keep sneezing. Oh my god. All right, yeah, guys. A creep craft is cry because Roblox shut down. What was that video? I'm not even gonna ask. Actually, I'm just gonna move past that one. Anyways, what is this? Is this just like a 3D intro for a YouTube channel? What is this? All these things are is just like random edits, and then it says July 30th, 2022. It's past that date. I don't think anything happened on July 30th. I'm so confused. Th th by the way, these three... Oh my god, I just realized. All three of these top videos are made by the same person. And they're all the same thing. And they all have a lot of views. What? I'm confused, guys. All right, let's move down to the, some actual, like, good ones. Such as Roblox is shutting down at 2030. <laughs> it has the sad music in the background, guys. Hold on. Roblox is shutting no, down at 2030. No. It can't be. ...to schools, and apparently it's gone. Uh-huh. Yes, it's real high, so that instantly means that it's actually Roblox shutting down. Adopt me pools, nursery, and shops, and more are- <laughs> Those aren't even, the, those aren't even the, the right games. I swear to God, they just went to, like, a scam game or something. But your avatars and Robux and more will go away. What else? What more could they take from me? My soul, my dignity. What else have they got? I don't even know, bro. <laughs> Anyways, good one. So, guys, don't worry. Roblox, we still have ten, eight more years on this Roblox platform, and then it's gonna go- It's gonna- Poof. On J January 1st, 2030, it's just gonna go... <laughs> Dude, what? Okay, okay, here we go. Here's a good one. Now, this one actually has a Roblox tweet that's completely real, guys. And I, I would never clickbait with some fake tweets, okay? That's so stupid. Everyone who does that is so lame. Like, I saw Creecraft do it. I would never. So, anyways, let's just read this fake tweet that, that's completely fake. <laughs> By the way, this text says, It's official. Roblox is shutting down, guys. Oh my god. I can't believe Roblox is actually shutting down right now. Hi, Robloxians. We need to clarify that the situation that is currently taking place... We've decided to shut Roblox down. We apologize for this inconvenience and we'll speak more about it later. We apologize for this inconvenience. I ask, a website that makes billions of dollars is just a simple inconvenience. Uh, by the way, this has, I don't know why they would post this because it's not like anything was going on on Roblox. This was during 614. That's June, June 14th. Roblox wasn't down or anything. I don't know why they posted it. Oh, I know why they posted this because as you can see right here, Roblox tweeted it this morning. So yeah, guys. You know, it has been three months and Roblox hasn't shut down, but you never know. Gosh, it's apparently going to happen soon, according to this tweet. All right, let, let's stop looking at these TikToks. I already know everyone's everyone's brain is melting, so I might as well just get onto the actual content that you guys are here for. And it's the real stories that could have ended Roblox's website in their tracks. And I, now you might just think I'm, I'm, I'm throwing out... Uh, jokes right now, but I'm serious. These were some of the biggest events in Roblox that could have led to a shutdown. 
kind of. But anyways, let's just get the first one out of the way that everyone probably knows, and it's the Chipotle thing, okay? Now, no, I don't think Roblox could have. Actually, maybe they could have, because if you really looked at, like, the 72-hour report thing that they post posted on Dev Forum after, like, a couple months after it happened, apparently the website had, like, a huge flaw. Like, this could have actually shut Roblox down for an extended period of time longer than what we had. If I read it correctly, bro, like, it was a pretty big outage. Like, there was something terribly wrong with the website, from what I've heard. But yeah, if you don't know what happened, t TLDR, there was a Chipotle event, and people kind of correlated that with this, even though it had no correlation. But basically, the website just slowly broke over, like, the span of a couple couple hours. You know, it started with uh, people not being able to search players or games, and then it, the catalog stopped working, and then the whole website just stopped working. I was there. I, I, I witnessed the whole thing. This was back in October of 2021, so uh, almost a year ago at this point. Time needs to stop going so fast. But yeah, um, that's what happened, and uh, people were kind of freaking out about it. it was, and Roblox was down for 72 hours, roughly, so that was pretty crazy. And uh, yeah, I think, I personally think if it could have went, it could have went a certain way okay especially hearing afterwards how they had like an actual flaw on the website i mean hey hey man that's pretty crazy now let's move on to the next story because that one everyone knows that one okay that one's lame let's get to the other ones that are kind of funny and that's uh, uh quackity okay so this is one that's talked about as well you might know about it it's kind of like a piece of a big chunk of roblox lore but instead of roblox shutting down in this instance they actually just shut down the small portion that was getting attacked but basically if you don't know what happened in this situation youtuber quackity who you might know from minecraft nowadays actually used to just raid random like online games like free online games like club penguin have a hotel and roblox and um in this specific case it was kind of funny i remember being there for two different uh roblox raids that he did um it was pretty funny and uh, i did actually get banned that was one of my first roblox bans is i actually posted on one of the forums a silly little thing and uh, they banned me for it um you know i i spent my 24 hours in prison and uh, i came out a better person okay roblox if you're watching this I i'm a changed man you can now invite me to the star program yeah tldr if you don't know roblox actually used to have a forum which is if you don't know what a forum is it's basically people can make threads and you can just talk to people and talk about stuff player and trading stuff it it's yeah and uh tldr this is how it got shut down uh, Quackity rated it twice and they gave up. <laughs> they straight up just went, nah, I don't care anymore. Which is kind of crazy that someone with just like a, a huge following can delete a whole portion of the Roblox website. Keep in mind, the forums wasn't no small little thing on Roblox. It was huge, man. The forums was such a big part of Roblox, especially trading. I know it was huge for trading. And uh, it, one day, it, all it took was one day, a silly little troll and it's gone. It was poofed. Now, how does this correlate to Roblox going down? I don't know. I wish they shut down. <laughs> that, that'd be a better outcome. If, if Quackity trolled them and they just turned the website off, they were like, eh, maybe next time. We'll have better luck next time. But now let's move on to the last story that I personally know nothing about because I'm not old enough to kind of be around Roblox at this time, but it was actually the 2012 hacking incident. So if you don't know what happened in 2012, let me try and fill you in the best I can, I guess. Basically, uh, Roblox got hacked big time like they really got hacked basically like a group of like three or four hackers got into like an admin panel and tldr what they were able to do is put out banners they were able to upload hats i mean that's where this face come from came from which you guys already know about and you can already see where i'm going with this roblox could have went completely uh, down for like days weeks maybe even forever no probably not forever but like at least a couple days bro especially in 2012 i feel like yes roblox was making millions and they were a huge company but i mean uh, i feel like they would have shut down if things didn't go the way they that it did they actually unironically hacked roblox anyways can someone commit another like big uh hoopla on roblox and actually make it shut down this time i'm getting really annoyed with this stinky website anyways bye bye